Chapter Six. Anna and Mr. Cheng talked to the police, but the police could tell them nothing more about the telephone call to the airport. Inspector Aziz telephoned two or three people, and then he talked to Anna again. When Anna left Inspector Aziz, she was much happier. Then she went to the prison to see Sarah. The man took her to Sarah's room. Anna and Sarah sat at the table, and the man stood and watched. It was a bad day, Mother. I'm sorry. Sarah said slowly. Her eyes were not red now, but she looked very tired. Her hands were near her mother's on the table. It wasn't a very good day, that's true, Anna said. But you have a very good lawyer, you know. The jury likes him. But it doesn't help," Sarah said. "There was heroin in the toothpaste tubes, and the tubes were in my bag. What can Mister Cheng do? The heroin was in my bag, Mother. The jury knows that." Anna looked at her daughter carefully. Perhaps Hassan put it there, Sarah," she said. "You like him, I know, and he looks nice. But, mother, I love him. I said that in court. You heard me. And Hassan loves me too. And he does not buy or sell heroin. I." Sarah stopped talking, and put her hands on her stomach. "What's the matter?" Anna asked. She looked at the man. "Quickly, she's ill. Get a doctor." The man ran from the room, and Anna put her arms round her daughter. She waited, and then Sarah sat up. It's all right, mother," she said. Her face was very white, but she looked a little better. It happens sometimes. I often feel ill, and I don't like to eat much. But it's not very bad. I think I'm going to stay alive because of it. She gave her mother a smile. What? What are you saying? What are you talking about? Anna cried. My baby. Sarah's face looked different now, half smiling, half afraid. Mother, don't be angry, please. I'm going to have a baby. It's Hassan's baby. I. We wanted to come to England, and tell you about it there, but now we can't. I love him, and he wants to be my husband, mother. Mother, please don't be angry. Anna's face was white now. For nearly a minute, she could say nothing. She wanted to cry, but she didn't. At last, she said, "Oh, Sarah, what's going to happen to this baby?" Sarah looked at her hands. Nothing, mother. I asked Mister Cheng about that. They can't kill me, you see. Because I'm going to have a baby. 
They can't kill a mother and her baby. That's the law. But that doesn't help Hassan. Anna heard a noise and looked at the door. Listen, Sarah, she said quickly. Before the doctor comes. I'm not angry, and I do love you, Sarah, of course. But listen, I talked to Inspector Aziz again today. I think he can help you, and Hassan too. So don't be afraid, please, and... The door opened, and the man came in with a woman doctor. Anna stood up. She took Sarah's hand. I'm going now, Sarah. But don't be afraid. You're going to be all right. I'm sure of it.